Hi, it's John. It's the 22nd of May 2016 and I'm round at my mate's house. It's uh, just beginning to rain a bit and I've just done some digging. Um, got some plant things that have got totally out of control so I can put them somewhere. Uh, so I've dug this plot here. It's taken me about an hour and a half or about just over an hour. Hard work. Um, some of these cyclists, they they burn about 200 watts. They, they've got about 200 watts of power. I just think I'm down to about 50, I just think. But anyway, sure and slow wins the day. Got it done. Uh, I've got the, um, some strawberries in here that need weeding. I was going to get rid of them and um, move from somewhere else and put something else in here, but... Uh, Got a bit late in the year now. The strawberries aren't doing too bad in there. I have weeded it once this year. Jolly old mole plant in there. Fox gloves. Buttercups. Don't like buttercups. And this area is Jerusalem artichokes. And just been weeding it a bit. See the artichokes are coming through. See once the artichokes really get going, they um They'll smother the weeds because they're, they're very big. But at the beginning, when they're small, the snails seem to like them. So it uh, can be a bit tender to start with. But once they get going, they're very um, strong. And this area here is also Jerusalem artichokes. Needs a bit of weeding. Spinach, um, Mashua just started to grow up the strawberry frame, and uh, there's Chinese artichokes down there as well. Um, do I zoom in on them? No, I've gone the wrong way. Oh, there they are. That's Chinese artichokes. They're like mint, but they have little little tuberous roots which can be eaten. But amongst all these weeds, there's self-set stuff grown, like spinach, perpetual spinach. And that's always useful because you never know when you might need some. So I let any anything self-set. There's some poppies, which are always fun, aren't they? self-set poppies in there. Um, we don't have any problem with growing borage around here because there's tons of borage about. That's the borage plant. Uh, not sure what other self-set things we have. Oh well we've got the um, normally get some self-set foxgloves. Uh, of course they're a biannual so they've managed to survive a year in the ground and now we're going to have some flowers. So it's all good. And the back's not too bad. So uh, get on doing a bit more. Well, that's got it all planted up. See what comes up. And I've also cleared the strawberry bed quite a bit. I haven't touched the nettles because I haven't got gloves with me, but uh, cleared a lot of the rubbish out of the strawberry plants. And Done a bit on the um, artichokes. So bye for now.